why would you go get chicken fingers when you can be like me and sit on commentary and shitpost in the Pichu Discord instead of actually doing what you're supposed to do when you're on commentary? I'd like to see someone make an animation of Ness tap dancing. Because whenever I see Ness's back air, all I can think of is tap dancing for some reason. Maybe it's just the shoes. I don't know. Those aren't even what tap dancing shoes look like. I've seen tap dancing shoes. That's not what they look like. But whenever I see Ness's back air, I'm like, ah, tap dancing. I don't know why. I don't think about that with any other character's back air. I don't look at Lucas's shoes and be like, ah, tap dancing. It's only ever Ness. It's like, I bet Ness tap dances. Tap dancing's impressive. I almost wish I could tap dance. But uh, not as much as I wish I could be a functional human being. Ooh. What a, what a match. Lucas has a tap... Well, you're right, but I don't think about tap dancing when I see Lucas. I think Lucas is the kind of character who sees Ness tap dancing really well, and he's just like, ah, I can do that, but better, and then he doesn't. But he doesn't say that he can do it better because he has like kind of weird self-esteem issues where he thinks he's really good at things, but doesn't want to say so because he, in the back of his mind, he knows he's really bad at things. No, I haven't played Mother 3, by the way, so I don't know anything about Lucas. You know, Meta Knight's boots are kind of like tap dancing shoes. Come to think of it. This is eye opening, really. This entire time I was like, I bet, I bet Ness tap dances. But really, it's Meta Knight who tap dances, and the, the edgy persona he goes for is just to make up for the fact that he tap dances, and he's like. He's really good at tap dancing and he enjoys it, but at the same time, he's worried about how people like will think of him. He's like, ah, oh, what if people don't think tap dancing is cool? So he goes for like this kind of edgy, sits in a dark room alone kind of thing, just so that no one would ever believe that he tap dances. But really, he does. He's the best tap dancer in the whole everywhere. And if he'd just be honest about it with himself and everyone else, they just appreciate him for who he was, but... That's the tragedy of Meta Knight's story, really. He wears a mask because he wears a mask whether or not he wears a mask. To hide who he really is. The tap dancing champion of Marshmallow Town. I should really just go to Smash 4 tournaments and start commentating there because then maybe Nintendo would listen to me and they'd be like, wow, we need to hire this guy. He's not dumb. This guy has good ideas for backstories that are completely not ridiculous. But alas, I don't like to play Smash 4 
so I could not ever get hired by Nintendo to make the lore for their characters. Fun fact, that's also the reason Meta Knight's so fast, is because when he does his down throw and starts tap dancing, he hopes that by being so fast, no one will really notice what he's doing. But he can't get by me. I see what's going on. I see the truth. When I was younger, I could never understand what Ness was saying. Like, okay, PK Thunder. I thought he was saying, eat this thunder. But it was always really weird because he throws it into himself. He just hits himself with it. So it's like some dude, like, approaching you with, like, a bat filled with, like, nails and, like, barbed wire coating. And he's like, huh, eat this. And then he trips and falls on it. He just hits his face in the bat. It's just, it's, it's a weird dynamic. But yeah, that is what I have to say about that. 